J3 Auction here. Today we're back and we're taking a look at the Bachman 282 Mikado steam locomotive in HO scale. So if you are not familiar with small trains or trains just in period, the Mikado was a steam class locomotive that was built in around the 1900s. And the more that I'm in my room. Steam class locomotive, and let's get it out of the box. And here's the bottom of the box. Here's the side of the box. Here's the back of the box. And this is a DCC and sound steam locomotive. So let's go take it out. Here she comes out. Yeah, box right there for you. So uh, first we have the quick start guide. If you're not familiar with Bachman, and has the controls in here. How to do everything. Dim the headlights, yeah, all that. We also have the exploded parts diagram. Here's the tender. Not sure if you can see that. That's the tender. There's the rest of the wheels, pilot truck and back, and the trailing truck. And we also have this. No. Oh. This is your paperwork. If you're, whenever you order mall trains, so it's a, I have no idea. More paperwork. And this is the coupon. So let's take it out of the package, see what we got. front of the locomotive you can see the, the light it also has a swinging bell very nice I have to use a pencil because I, my fingers aren't small enough well, apparently they're small enough to do that and also you have right here all the pistons you have the water pipes I think I don't really know much about steam engines get the whistle valves tanks no idea what that is. We got the grab irons right here. Here's the cab. You can see the number. 1925. We got the fire box. More water lines. Take a look at the top of the locomotive. It has non shuttable I don't know why they're open, but non shuttable roof. And you see the little hump, that's for the boiler. Take a look at the front. See the unlit marker lights. If you look down here at the bottom, you see the cow catcher and the front coupler and the stairways. The other side of the locomotive. Exactly the same as the other side, except for a little different in the piping. Again, the cab. And I can't really detach the tender. Okay, now let's take a look at the tender detail. You got the really realistic coal load. Very nice. Look in there. You think I, I see if I can zoom in? Yeah, you see a little wiring. And underbody, not very detailed. But you do have these nice trucks. You have the rear headlight. You have the ladder. You have the rear coupler. So that's the locomotive details itself. Now let's take a look at the function. Okay, so here we are on the layout that, just, that is like literally just on my floor. Let's go ahead and put on the lights. There's a light. You can also dim the light with. Okay. You can also dim the light with 
and I am using a DCC Easy Command Control Center, so I am going to be doing, well, yeah, on here. If you press function, then press 7, that controls the light, dimming, and lighting. I'm going to hit bright. Then if you press 8, that turns off the sounds, as you just saw. Then F1, F4, oh, poop, it's moving. <laughs> F4 is steam release. F3 is short whistle. F2 is long whistle. And F1 is bell. There are the sounds and features. Now I'm going to turn off my lights so you guys can see what it looks like in that. Well, if it was in real life. I'm not sure if they, they have one, two, two Mikado. I think it's a heavy Mikado still running at the Grand Canyon. So if you want to go see one of these locomotives, you can. Just take a trip down to the Grand Canyon. Here's light dimming again. No, oh, that's the sounds. You see a big old difference. Now let's do some running. I'm not sure how many speed steps, so I'm just gonna say like one or two. Uh, I think that's like one speed step. Yeah, it's pulling a like a box car and a dining car and a coach and a observation car. So and it's not really. And these cars are actually pretty heavy to pull. Two speed steps. Three, four, five. That's halfway. Full speed. Slow down. Take her back in reverse. You guys seen these cars that were from the train store video. Cost me two hundred and fifty three dollars. I recommend getting it, it's worth the money. Are you serious? These cars keep on derailing. I mean, uncoupling. I need to replace these couplers. Okay. And that's the locomotive, and I'll end y'all off with a run by. Thank you. And remember, keep on being ultimate. Peace.